G'day Paul here down by the Brisbane River and we're continuing our pre-Easter meditations reading from the book of Matthew. We're looking at Matthew 26 um, from verse 69. Peter disowns Jesus. Now Peter was sitting out in the courtyard and a servant girl came to him. You also were with Jesus of Galilee, she said. But he denied it before them all. I don't know what you're talking about, he said. Then he went out of the gateway where another servant girl saw him and said to the people there, This fellow was with Jesus of Nazareth. He denied it again with an oath. I don't know the man. After a little while, those standing there went up to Peter and said, Surely you are one of them, your ancient Surely you are one of them. Your accent gives you away. Then he began to call down curses and he swore to them, I don't know the man. Immediately a rooster crowed. Then Peter remembered the word Jesus had spoken. Before the rooster crows, you will disown me three times. And he went outside and wept bitterly. How hard that would have been for Peter. He denied the Lord and then he hears the rooster crowing. What a very difficult time for him. And he wept bitterly. Similarly, Judas gets into similar strife. But chapter 27. Early in the morning all the chief priests and the elders of the people made their plans how to have Jesus executed. So they bound him, led him away and handed him over to Pilate, the governor. When Jesus... Verse 3, when Judas, who had betrayed him, saw that Jesus was condemned, he was seized with remorse and returned the 30 pieces of silver to the chief priests and the elders. I have sinned, he said, for I have betrayed innocent blood. What is that to us? They replied. That's your responsibility. So G Judas threw the money into the temple and left. Then he went away and hanged himself. So the chief priest picked up the coins and said, it is against the law to put this into the treasury since it is blood money. So they decided to use the money to buy the potter's field as a burial place for foreigners. That is why it has been called the field of blood to this day. Then what was spoken by Jeremiah the prophet was fulfilled. They took the 30 pieces of silver, the price set on him by the people of Israel, and they used them to buy the potter's field as the Lord commanded me. So there, that's what happened to two of the disciples. Peter denies him and regrets it. Judas oh, was so convicted that uh, his saviour had been taken off to be tried so that he goes out and hangs himself. So, terrible. We need to be vigilant how we respond when people want to know, are we Christian? We need to be vigilant. We don't want to deny Jesus like Peter did and then have all that condemnation on ourselves we, we want to be bold Jesus says you deny me before men I will deny you before the Father so are you happy to say I'm a Christian I'm a follower of the Lord Jesus Christ you think about it now yeah, you get into the word see what the word says to you and may the word get into you see you later